to say. And let me tell you, it wasn't always this way. And our sideline reporter is David Aldridge. And so off the tip, it's Oklahoma City. To the right side. A wide open look here for Caruso. The shot's good. Gilgis Alexander making the play. And if you claim to be a basketball purist, and Greg, I know you do, one thing you gotta love watching is great ball movement. Which is something both of these teams take pride in. It's always fun to watch with the ball and look to make each other better. Jokic. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. I have a lot of respect for Jokic's feel for the game. He plays the right way, sees everything, great vision, and he processes what he sees so quickly. Now here's Caruso, trying to find Gilgis Alexander. Gets it to him. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to well, find This him. early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Murray, good. Well, Murray absolutely has that range. He just needs to find the look he likes, and he'll knock it down. And though the Nuggets have some excellent outside shooters, Clark, they've been more prolific inside the arc the last couple years. Yeah, that's exactly right. I mean, they were an extreme example of that, Kevin. First what? than most people would think when looking at the Nuggets. Pass to Holmgren. Here's Caruso. Just five on the clock. Oklahoma City needs to get off a shot. That's rock solid defense right there. Jokic bodied him up and then affected the trajectory of the shot. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Jokic is. Got his second basket of the game. Quarter basketball. Greg, everything they're doing is working right now. Good run they have going right now. The momentum is huge. And Joker doesn't get up too often, but when he slams it down, it feels like he's trying to bring the basket with him. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thanks very much. He had a chance to catch up with Michael Malone. He said SGA has this special ability to roll a defender into a slower pace and then suddenly make a quick move. Coach feels the attention has to be on him. He wants to force somebody else to beat them. Guys? Thank you, David. You know, it's clear that Gordon is one of the best dunkers in the game, always looking to bring the Thunder. And that one's good, Caruso. And a nice and inside pressure. Oh! Ooh. Yes, come on! Bring it! Gordon's eyebrows go up when he sees an opportunity to drop the hammer. This guy is a phenomenal athlete who throws it down with some major force. Here's Holmgren. Two free throws. It's going to be on Yogi. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the official. To the paint. Here's Gordon. And it's Gordon finishing it off. And I've been impressed with the unselfishness, but also getting guys the ball where they can do something with it. He is delivering a lot of room service times tonight. One sweet one after another. And that one's good, Caruso. Cashing in on the two. Pass to Jokic. Fires the three. The Thunder pull it in. Boy, they dodged one there, guys. I mean, he got the wide-open look that he wanted, just didn't knock it down. Here's Dort. And a great assist by Gildas Alexander as that one goes in. That'll tie this game up. And when you have Dort on your side, this is what he brings on the offensive end. Great off the catch and fire. How about dueling from long range, just going at each other? Looks to me like there could be something personal taking place here. And stolen by Gordon. Here's Murray. And he's fouled. In that instance, you could see where Murray was able to take advantage of his size in that situation. And Greg, something that is so important to this team, Jamal Murray's shot creation. It is, Kevin. He creates so much with the ball or off of it. The work he puts in on offense frees up everything for his teammates. Great competitor who's really a perfect fit with this court.
Jordan the screen. And it's Murray with the jam. Tell you what, if Murray's on your team, you got to feel comfortable when he's working the pick and roll. His shooting, speed, and passing all make him hard to guard. To end the run on the wing, Williams. Back to Holmgren. And here's Gilgis Alexander outside. And so it's Denver bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. There now, now the offense of the Nuggets. Straight away, they, they've opened things up offensively with skillful passing, running smart plays, and just setting guys up for success. Two points. That one goes. Set his first points of the game. Attacking in transition, the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. It's Dort on the wing. Some nice passing by Oklahoma City here. Carries it from three-point range. Dort's got six. Blue Holmgren, great court awareness and really unselfish. Pass to Jokic. Jokic a screen. Here's the teardrop. Good. Nice assist from Westbrook. He's got 13. Quick reaction that time by Jokic. Very impressive. Good at rolling to the right spot after setting the screen and doing it quickly. Down low. Jokic craps the miss. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Alden. David. Kevin, the Thunder take it one step at a time. All-star Shea Gilgis Alexander says, I think that's why we've been able to get better. Attack the day, the program in front of us. We all have the right intentions and want to win at the end of the day. Kevin. And that attitude growing by leaps and bounds. Thank you, David. Here's Gordon. And it's Jokic in the corner. Shot clock at two. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. To the inside. Stolen by Gordon. And here we go. Murray heading to the hoop. And the quick feet of Murray really doing an extraordinary job getting out in transition. Now, Gilgis Alexander. There's a screen by Williams. Wants to get it over to Dort and does. And wait to finish. Yeah, but look at the, ba the basket guy still shaking. Well, I tell you what, he loaded up as much power as he could behind that two-hand. Pass to Murray. Outside Gordon. Here's Westbrook. Westbrook double team. And it's Jokic in the corner. Jokic from distance. Hey, Clark, no one covers the college game like you. And for new pros, one of the biggest challenges is adjusting to life in the NBA and the play itself. Speed and size, Kevin. I mean, that's where it really starts. You've got to be in great condition. But the speed and size of the players at the NBA level is unlike any other basketball you play. Everybody in the NBA is big and athletic and done at a much faster pace. And given that Holmgren is seven feet tall, he's a threat to throw it down at any time. And he just big boy right there. The height advantage he's got down low, really difficult for them to defend. Pick by Williams. On the wing, Williams. Pass to Caruso. On the wing, Williams. Back to Gilgis Alexander. Outside, Dort. There's the triple. And Shea Gilgis Alexander with the three. three. Gilgis Alexander's got seven. Well, this is why SGA is a focal point of this offense because of that ability. Back to Jokic. Murray outside. Launches a three. Thunder with the rebound. And out of bounds as the Nuggets game to be smarter in those exchanges. Pass to Westbrook. Now Gordon. The three. It's Chet Holmgren with the rebound. Three second difference between shot clock and game. Clock. 
shooting. And when it comes to physical play, it's hard to get the best of Dort. He invites contact at both ends. And he makes both free throws. Here in the second. To the middle. Here's Gordon. And then Gordon with the dunk. So good to see Murray, not just as a scorer, but driving as a passer, too. Pass to Caruso. Wants to get it to Holmgren and does. Over Jokic. Holmgren can't hit. Westbrook wide open. Beats the buzzer. Wow. Yeah, that's just an amazing play to get that ball off in time. I agree. I mean, it's so the Denver Nuggets. Their lead at 11 points to end the quarter. See if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. Right side, Jordan. Williams with the steal. And pushing it up here. Here is Oklahoma City. Some nice passing by Oklahoma City here. Drains it from beyond the arc. Gilgis Alexander's got 10. And if you're the guy who has to guard him, it is never going to be an easy night for you. Here we are sizing up GA Jalen Williams, and his shooting has got to be his biggest strength. Absolutely. He's great at spacing the floor for his teammates with his catch and shoot abilities, but he's equally gifted shooting off the dribble. Caruso. And it's out of bounds. Here's Murray. He's got nine. Pass to Westbrook. Shot by Gordon. Wide open. No oh, good with the triple. Under trailing by eight. A little over a minute gone here in the second half. And here is Gilgis Alexander. He's got ten. Williams with the ball. Now here's Holmgren. And Jordan sends it back. Hey, you know he's around, and that's the Nuggets leading by eight. And a wide open look for Porter. Off target from three point range. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. One three. Holmgren sinks the three pointer. Holmgren's press of the outside jumper. Holmgren generates space for this offense. Jokic gets it done right in front. In close. Oh, such a field shot there. The floater. It's Dort on the wing. Left side, Gilgis Alexander. The kick out to Williams. Pass to Holmgren. And he banks in the layup. He's got eight. And great job from Holmgren. I, I like when he shows confidence attacking inside. And it's Jokic in the corner. How good on the three. And Gilgis Alexander's got the ball here for the Oklahoma City Thunder. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half. The kick out to Williams. Pass to Caruso. Just four to shoot. Here's Holmgren. Over in the corner, Williams. And again, Oklahoma City with the triple. And perimeter scoring was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. Pass to Murray. Gordon outside. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. Third quarter action in just under three and a half minutes of gone. Inside. Williams. That's good. That's seven points for Williams. I'll tell you, they're right in the momentum. Well, it starts with defense. They got some stops, scored some buckets after that, and now we've got ourselves a ball game. Outside Gordon. Pass to Murray. Another three for Denver. This is Murray's game. A shoot-first combo guard who's ready to fire as soon as he has it. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. 
Thank you, Kevin. Nikola Jokic may not be the most physically gifted, but there's an old saying in basketball, you're as fast as you can anticipate. LeBron James says he sees plays before Special. they happen. Kevin? You know, his mind for the game is just on another level. We appreciate that report. Jokic has such an efficient, soft stroke, especially from this in-between area. And it's out of bounds to the Thunder, is it? Here's Gilgis Alexander. Makes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals, five for eight in the game. Doing good work in self on the perimeter when he can be effective down low. Jokic, no good. Here is Williams. He's got seven. Pass to Caruso. To the paint. Here's Gilgis Alexander. And they pick up two. Now just a four-point nugget lead. And as we end the third quarter, a great game. Both teams playing well. Under trailing by four. On the wing, Williams. Pass to Caruso. Shoots it. It's hauled in by Michael Porter. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. Williams with a clean look. That three off the mark. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. It's stolen by Gilgis Alexander. It's Dort on the wing. To the middle. Here's Holmgren. And he makes the bucket. Gets take the that. Holmgren, he knows defenses want to rough him up a little bit. And he welcomes the challenge. David Holmgren. Thanks very much. During that last break, I got a chance to hear what Michael Malone said to his team. He told him he liked the way they were working, but he said we have to really get after it. All we need is a couple of stops. Keep your focus. We'll see if they can close it out. Kevin? Thanks, David. It's Gilgis Alexander with the try. And another one in the scoring column for him. He's 7 of 10 from the field. And moving with such speed, the quickness of mine. Outside Jordan. Gordon for three. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Over in the corner, Dort. Down low. And the dunk by Holmgren. You love how he challenged throughout this one. Hey, defense is taking a back burner. Secondary on the marquee, but who doesn't love a game like this? Let's go. I like offense. And although an undersized center, more than making up for it with some serious hops. For three, Holmgren. That's no good. He is 5 of 11 shooting from the field for the game. It's tipped. Back to Jordan. And it's Jordan with the jam. There's a reason why Jordan's a high percentage shooter. Shooting percentage, a function of the kind of shots you get. He opts mainly for dunks. Holmgren gets the bucket. And you want him taking big shots. That one was as easy as it gets. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind the layup. Come on now. My goodness. Outside Porter. Now, here's Jokic. Five on the clock. The well, Nuggets need to get a shot off here. Murray, no good. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Dort misses. And so it's Jokic with it. He brings it up for the Nuggets. They've led by as many as 11 points. Deep two for Murray. And he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. And the Nuggets lead by four. Back to Gilgis Alexander. To the inside. Holmgren. And a great assist by Gilgis Alexander as that one goes in point for Chet Holmgren. The power, the power of Jokic. Wow. When it's an important possession, Jokic steps up big. 
Back to Gildas Alexander. Pass to Holmgren. Oklahoma City moving it around. And Gildas Alexander. Here we go. Inside Dort. Three pointer. It's hauled in by Jokic. The Nuggets leading by four. Murray, no good. Outside Williams. Back to Caruso. Off target from outside. You know, to cut deficits, you've got to be making smart basketball plays out there. Taking care of the ball is a way to play and attack both and get to the line. And, you know, the defense gets their money's worth on that foul. Stopping the layup and not giving up the and one. And he does get the second one. And that puts them up by five. And I'm sure he would like to have had all of those, but he's still able to pad the lead. Off with the layup. And here's the fast break. Porter leading the way. Gordon with it. Pass to Jordan. And it's Jokic in the corner. Over Holmgren. And here's Jokic. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. To the middle. Outside for Murray. Good. And a nice assist from Porter. And the Nuggets lead by eight. So the Nuggets win it. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the first step in becoming a good team is your ability to win at home. And they really seem to revel in that opportunity. And, and this is what they came out to do. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast.